Good evening. <clears throat> Good evening. My name is Stephanie Fries. Um, I'm the local government relations manager at Ford here in Michigan. I wanted to be here this evening to express Ford's excitement for this project and becoming a member of the community. We take our responsibility to be a good neighbor seriously. We plan to have a community town hall in the next few weeks where we can answer more of your questions, but I wanted to take this opportunity to address a few topics. This project represents a $3.5 billion investment by Ford. Ford will own and run the plant and will be responsible for hiring the 2,500 workers that will be employed at the wholly owned Ford subsidiary. We are working with local government to ensure the Marshall community has the infrastructure and first response support necessary to support the growth the community may see. There is no foreign investment in this plant. It is not a joint venture. Again, it is a wholly owned Ford subsidiary. Ford will own the land. The government of China has no role in this project and no tax dollars will go to CATL. The facility will produce lithium iron phosphate batteries, also known as LFP batteries. Lithium, iron, and phosphate are earth abundant materials. Many other automakers have LFP batteries in their electric vehicles, including Honda and Tesla. LFP, LFP batteries produced at the battery plant here in Marshall will comply with the same safety and quality standards <coughs> that Ford requires across all its manufacturing facilities globally and that customers have come to expect. In addition, we've heard concerns about preserving Marshall's historic charm, and we don't want to change that either. By creating 2,500 jobs in the area, we intend for this project to restore the job losses this area has seen over the years. Mm -hmm. Additionally, we have heard your concerns about the barns and have begun preliminary conversations with the state. We also wholeheartedly agree that protecting the Kalamazoo River is a priority. That's why we are so excited to work with local government to carve out the southern portion of the site to put it into a conservation easement. This property will be, will be preserved for generations to come and protected against future industrial development. The Ford Fund, Ford's philanthropic arm, is providing resources and conducting community outreach to explore how the public can best access and utilize this space. We are committed to ongoing engagement with the community to share our updates and plans. <clears throat> we plan to be present in Marshall and Calhoun County throughout engagement opportunities such as town halls, listening sessions, and community meetings. Again, we are planning for a community engagement session in a few weeks where we can answer more of your questions and discuss our plans to develop a local workforce. I must stress that Ford takes our responsibility to be a good neighbor seriously. We look forward to learning more about what is important to the community and becoming part of, of the fabric of the region. 